Hello everyone, welcome back to another watching. Today I've got a quick box opening of one, a watch that I've actually been holding on to for quite a while and I really, really, it's been hard not to open this one up. Um, but I'm so far behind on a bunch of the other watches, this one has sat on the back burner. This is a watch I got off of Kickstarter. Before we get to that, do a quick wrist check and you'll see that I'm still wearing that Motor Time Chicane from the last video I just did. Um, if you want to check that out, look at the previous video. Also guys, if you like Spinnaker, Aviate, or Ballast watches, make sure you click in the notes below and uh, you can save yourself a little bit of money. And also guys, I have another YouTube channel where I'm working on old cars, just trying to keep them going down the road. So if you're into old cars, make sure you check that one out and subscribe as well. Like I said, this is a watch that I got off of Kickstarter and it's a company I've followed for quite some time. The crazy part is it's been long enough that I that I ordered this because Kickstarter is kind of a pain. You, you know, you're, you're more or less funding the projects and I've had a few watches off of Kickstarter. My Sal Baltimore ones have come off of Kickstarter and I've really, really liked these. I followed this company for a while and I have wanted one of their watches for quite some time. I like the, uh, the case that they have. Nice zip up case here. Nice leather case. Let's take a look at what we got. Like I said, I don't even remember the color, so I'm pretty excited to see it myself. All right, so we got the book, got a tool, and all right. So it looks like I didn't go too crazy on the color, which they definitely had some really really nice colors like i said um so this watch is from stratton stratton straighten and let me get the plastic off if i can wow kind of hard to do from behind the camera sometimes so this is the legera and this is the bullhead version they have a standard version with the crown and the pushers on this side or the bullhead which i love the look of the bull head. I mean, super cool. I like that leather strap. Look at the case design there. To be honest, I don't remember a lot of the specs on this one, but we're gonna go ahead and throw it on wrist really quick. So this is just my normal box opening to take a look. I can tell you this one is a quartz movement. They do have automatic versions of this at the time. I just didn't have the, the extra money for the automatic. So even the quartz one, I, I think I was the 120th backer on, on a Kickstarter and it was around $330 plus shipping, which I never include the cost of shipping in the watch, but I think it was about 25 bucks for the shipping and look how cool that is um so yeah the quartz version was about 333 dollars i think if you go to their site now it's 4.99 around there roughly um which i will end up doing a follow-up on this let you guys know what i actually think of it all said and done man that crown is cool i like that little bit of twist on there but i am excited like this one I have been waiting for, and I'm excited I finally opened it up. Let me know what you guys think of this one in the comments below, and stay tuned for a follow-up. I guarantee you, you guys will see this one as, you know, my watch of the day quite a few times, just because I love the retro designs. Um, I will link to their site in the notes below as well, in case you want to check out some of their other pieces, but man, that is cool. Let me know, again, let me know what you guys think of this one. You can tell I'm excited. As always, guys, thanks for watching.